As small as I am on YouTube, it makes absolutely no sense why Apple is giving me an exclusive view of the iPhone 11. Uh, <clears throat> I'm, what I meant to say was, what's in this box? What's up guys, Benji D here from GetFix, and I really can't believe this, but Apple sent me out the iPhone 11. This is the prototype, it is not a fully functional phone, but you're going to get a sneak peek at what the iPhone 11 will look like in the future. A very small channel like mine is getting an exclusive look at the iPhone 11. Apple does not benefit in this whatsoever. So I don't get it. Once again, they did design the box like this on purpose simply because they don't want anybody intercepting the package and trying to see what's inside of it. So blank white package means nothing important. Whoa. Wow. Wait a second. Something's off here. That's the iPhone 7. Hold on. Oh, wow. Guys, the iPhone 11 in the flesh. Whoa. I'm pretty sure this is a 16 megapixel back facing camera. There's a screen on the back of the phone and also on the front of the phone. I've actually never seen anything like that before in my life. What are these? They're clicking. Wow, guys, Apple pretty much put a universal remote control on every single one of the models of the iPhone 11. So you can pretty much control your TV using this built-in universal remote control. It's speeding out Samsung because Samsung is getting rid of the IR blaster. Come on, Samsung. It also folds. Oh, by the way, Apple has added the headphone jack again. Alright guys, that pretty much wraps it up for this video. If you want to see a part 2 to this video, let me know down in the comments below. I might actually make a part 2 to this video where I show you all the cool features and new apps. Anyways guys, Benji D here from GetFix. You know I'm out. Peace.